hello everyone welcome back thank you for watching today i will be making some very easy home decor diys using mostly dollar tree items so i really hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if you do please give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and don't forget to hit the notification bell button so you can get notified every time i upload with that being said now let's craft I will be using two of these Dollar Tree little chalkboard houses and some large popsicle sticks. The large popsicle sticks I got them from Walmart. Now this DIY was inspired by Barbara, the country lily DIY decor. She did something similar like this but she used more of these chalkboards and I will be using popsicle sticks instead. So I'm going to start by cutting all the edges of the popsicle sticks. Now for this, I started with one side first and then I used some painter's tape to um, tape them together and then I used my handsaw to cut this so like that everything was nice and straight. The next thing I will be doing is gluing the sides and I use a box so like that the sides can be straight. As you can see the box is too big so what I did first is glue one side first and then I glue the other. I will be gluing three of the popsicle sticks on each side and at the bottom I glued four of them. So I used ten popsicle sticks in total. And that is all I'm going to be gluing. You can add like a little dowel at the top. So this can be like a caddy. But instead I decided to just leave it like this. Once I was finished I painted this. And I used this little combination I made. Which I'll have all the paints I used to make this color down in the description box. And I did paint everything even the inside now. This is a dry erase board, so this is very easy to clean up, so don't worry if you like paint on it. Even if it dries, it'll still be easy to remove. Now, once this is nice and dry, all I did was add some mason jars inside with some greenery, and that is it. For my next project, I will be using this beautiful 5x7 Dollar Tree picture frame. I am going to remove the glass and the back and instead I will be adding some of the large popsicle sticks which I'm going to cut to size first. To glue the popsicle sticks, I'm using hot glue. Now, one thing I wish I would have done was like measure in between each popsicle stick, like have like a divider. I think that's how you say it. Because when I glue these, I accidentally glue them um, very uneven. But I still like how that looks. As you can see, one of them looks way too more that way. But anyways, once I was finished, I then painted this using the same paint. Now this was very easy to remove some of that paint but I did remove it before it dried. Once I was done all I did was add a little small hook that I grabbed from the Dollar Tree and the wreath and that is it for this beautiful wall decor.
For my next project, I will be using two of these dry erase little boards and I'm going to paint them using the same color I've been using. So for this project, I'm going to make like a two piece set. So I'm going to use some of these leaves. These are new to Dollar Tree if I come in a pack. So I'm going to use only two and then I'm going to glue them one going one the one direction and then the other one going the other direction and I'm also removing the little stem I had I'm using hot glue to glue these Now to cover the little stem at the bottom, I will be making some jute twine bows and add them at the bottom. And that is it. This was very easy and simple to do. For my next project, I will be using two of these Dollar Tree wood palettes. So I'm going to make like two in one. So you can either make like a wall decor or make a little tray. Tray, sorry. So I'm going to start by removing the st strings from one of them. Now, if you want to make a tray with this, then you can't leave the string on. Then I will be gluing these together using hot glue to make this more sturdy. I will be adding a popsicle stick in the center. Now to paint this, I will be using the same paint I have been using and then that is it. Now I'm going to show you the tray first. So I did add the little string bags just so I can show you how it would look. Option two will be the wall decor, so you will remove one of the strings and then add like a little planter. The one I'm using is this pencil holder that I already had that I painted the same color. All I did was just glue it and add some greenery. Now to decorate the planter a little more, I decided to use this new Dollar Tree lace and just add it around it. And that is it for this wall decor. For my next project, I'm using this little wood box. Now, mine was from Michaels and it was only a dollar. Dollar Tree does carry some similar ones to this that you can use instead. So I'm going to start by removing the little knob part first and then I'm going to glue the inside part at the bottom. Now I'm going to paint it the same color I have been using and after this is dry, I am going to add like some greenery at the top and a little succulent on the other side now you can use this two different ways you can use it like this or the other option i will be showing you is by adding i don't know like a succulent or a little planter at the bottom and then use this like a pencil holder And that is it for these quick and easy Dollar Tree DIYs. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. 
let me know down in the comment section which one's your favorite because i would love to know so thank you so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already and until next time bye Thank you.